Now it's time to make some cold brew. This has actually been sitting for 48 hours because I just didn't have time yesterday. Um, but one of the things I want you to see that's really cool about the new cold brew is the silicone bottom, which means it's going to protect it when you put it down on surfaces because it is glass. I'm going to make some cold foam because I'm a little obsessed these days using our frother. I just use regular um, almond milk, but I do like to put some skinny syrup in there. I've got several flavors that I like. Right now I'm using vanilla almond, put the top on, and I want cold brew. So can you see that? Yeah. Okay, so I go over to the fourth one where it's blue, hit it, and now it is twirling it up. One of the really cool things about our cold brew is that the little whisk at the bottom is offset. We did all kinds of testing and found that was the right place to put it for the best froth. Okay, here is the filter. And the way it comes off is right here. That just comes out. And then this would come up. Ooh, I can see, I put a little cinnamon in it. I can smell the cinnamon. Put the lid back in until you hear it click. There we go. So I'm just gonna fill it up a little. Somebody mentioned salt. Okay, grandma, thank you Jody for telling that salt. My grandma used to always put a few grains of salt into her coffee before she brewed it in the regular machine, and that is to smooth it out. Um, also gives you essential minerals. The other tip I got from Jody was that um, the amount, the, the reason that cold brew is higher in caffeine has to do with the amount of water time to bean soak that elevates the caffeine, okay? So if you're like me and you really do enjoy your caffeine, you're gonna be happy with this. I have found adding my syrup and mine is a sugar-free, uh, to my cold foam. It's just delicious. Just the flavor you get in the cold foam, it's like a party going on. So uh, for those of you that have been going off to fancy coffee places for a long time, you already knew this. I'm new to the game. The right way. And I did use a clear cup on purpose so that you could see the foam and all that goodness come together. There you go. My cold brew is ready. Look at that, it looks like magic. Cheers. Mm. Sweet, yummy cold foam, and then the bitter coffee comes through.